Okay, so we're going to try to work this X Ray United 7. And he's running in MSHV mode, which is not like normal WSJ2 Hound mode. So we're going to give this uh, a shot here. And I believe, as long as we don't select Hound mode, um, if we, as long as we don't select Hound mode, um, it should just work. It'll attempt to do the QSO like a normal um, FT8 QSO. Uh, so we're going to find out here, because I'm not seeing stations that are going back to him, calling him on his, or his pl applying on his frequency. Uh, I should confirm that, though. Okay, here we go. Oh, there it goes. So, <laughs> he just came back. WW2DX, XSMGNY. I'm sending a report, so let's see if he actually responds, even though my transmit frequency is still at 1370. This will be interesting. Okay, there it is. So we got the WW2DX R73, and uh, we got the log it. So we're gonna we're gonna log it here. Done. So okay. So this so this is this is good. So if a station if a DX station is running MSHV mode and not Hound mode, all you have to do is make sure you're transmitting above 15. I think it's a thousand. Also a thousand hertz. Yeah, we're at 1370. So as long as you're transmitting above 1370, a uh, uh, thousand hertz, um, just click the call and let it do its thing, and it should just automatically, um, just like we saw, it'll it'll do the sequencing and make the uh, contact. So great. So a quick quick little video showing the um, FT8 MSHV mode on RHR. Good luck, DX from Lee, WW2DX, from Mohan Radio.